Good morning, my beauties, and welcome to the 2021 Holiday Tribute Store. This is a moment that I've been waiting for for quite a while. Now, I went to last year's HHN Tribute Store, but not the Holiday Tribute Store. So this is my very first time going into the Holiday Tribute Store. So we're not gonna waste any time. Let's just go on in and check it out. I do wanna mention really quickly, if you saw the last vlog, you'll know I talked about getting something very special for the Tribute Store. Well, this is it right here. I am going to be turned into a sort of cartoon me. And hopefully I'm in there. I'm not 100% sure, because I know they've been Eh, kind of slacking with it. Here we go. Alrighty, so here's the entryway. Already, um, wait, I smell something good. That's besides the point. Alrighty. So look over here, got the Elf of the Year. So I take it these are probably the kids of maybe the visual team or just whoever designed this store in the first place. Oh, look, <laughs> we got some pets. <laughs> That's adorable. Going into the first room. Ooh. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's the toy factory. <laughs> wow. Oh my gosh. Let's go ahead and take a look at some of the toys, shall we? Look, we got a bunch of SpongeBob stuff. We got SpongeBob, Plankton. We got a Bill the SpongeBob. I've actually never heard of this, but some people said it's been around for a while. We also have what looks to be a pillow pet. Uh, yeah, it's a SpongeBob pillow pet. Pretty cool. We also got some stuff from Trolls. How to Train Your Dragon, Shrek. We got all of it. So look at all the cute plushes. Like, look, look at the cat. Look how cute he is. Oh my gosh, I love him. But also, I think I found the first thing I want to purchase. Look, it's the little things. <laughs> Oh, they're so cute, but look, look at him. He, he, he just, he got a squishy little tushy. He got a squishy little tushy. His little flappy feet, <laughs> so cute. Check this out, we got Santa's little area right here. We got a huge portrait of him. I wonder if it's like sort of digital, like how the HHN icon portraits were. We also have the naughty and nice list. Hmm, I wonder if my name is in here. Now the fact that Santa's throne is right here, it kind of begs the question of whether or not Santa's gonna be in here. And then we also have what looks to be some ornaments. So definitely stock up on the univer yeah. on your universal ornaments if you want to. Oh no, Kevin, watch out. We got an Earl the Squirrel hoodie. And again, more Shrek, Donkey and the Dragon, Light Fury and Toothless. Oh my gosh, hang on. Oh my gosh. This is adorable. Okay, I need to put these plushes down, otherwise I'm probably gonna buy some. And then we got some Coca-Cola ornaments. Oh my gosh, look at the little polar bear. He's so tiny. Oh my gosh, I'm going nuts. I'm going nuts. And there's also what looks to be some sort of do-it-yourself figures. So yeah, they're just basic pieces of wood and you just paint over them. Pretty nice, actually. And then we got some toys from Jurassic Park, Jurassic World, whichever one you want to call it. Even this blue mask. We all know Facebook mom is gonna go viral with this thing. But I do want to say, get a load of this ginormous nutcracker, like cheese and rice. This is absolutely phenomenal. All right, making our way into Earl the Squirrel's Christmas Curios Museum and Emporium. Oh my goodness. So I think we should start with Earl's Christmas tree. So if you look closely up there, you will find Earl chewing at some wires. That's adorable. Oh, uh, some little Earl plushies. Oh, oh my gosh. This is really soft. Really soft and really cuddly. I like him. He's cute. But oh my gosh, they have candles. They have candles. I did not get a candle for HHN, but I might have to get one for Christmas. What is it? Balsam and pine. I really don't know what balsam is, and I know I'm allergic to pine, so this should go well. Oh. Oh, that is fantastic. I will, how much? $20? 
Not yet. Not yet. I'll be back in here soon. When some stuff starts to go into effect, then I'll get this candle. And then a whole bunch of Earl merch. We got some hoodies, sweaters, bags. Oh my gosh, it's great. All right, let's take a look at some of Earl's sweet treats. You know I love my treats. All right, I'm already loving it so far. Look at the cupcakes. Got a Christmas tree cupcake, white Christmas cupcake. Oh, the macaroons, and see, the lighting from the camera doesn't do it enough justice, but they look fantastic. Oh my gosh, the cookie dough balls. And they're actually like, Christmassy stuff. They're not just regular balls like during HHN. Then the brownies, the Christmas tree brownie, Yule log brownie. Alrighty, now y'all know I love my cheesecake, so I might have to get one of these mini globe cheesecakes at some point, but they're eight dollars for those little things. And all the cocoa bombs, they look so pretty. Oh my gosh. Th this, this one right here, I'm really digging. Then we got these moose mugs. I'm hoping that, I'm guessing the entire thing is edible. Regardless, they look good. Now, while I'm really not the biggest fan of gingerbread, these actually look pretty decent. Now, I'm sure some of y'all knew how I was a sucker for the whoopie pie, so I might have to get this whoopie pie at some point. What is, I'm taking it that's like a candy cane whoopie pie. This gingerbread cookie sandwich is new. That looks good, too. And, of course, the ever-popular jar cake. So this one, yep, red velvet cake, Nutella buttercream, and hazelnut. Okay, so uh, basically as much diabetes as it can get. Then look at this. The chocolate jar cake, hot cocoa buttercream, and mini marshmallows. Oh, good grief. I would die for that. And then the boot cake. Oh, man, I take it that's... Is that cookies and cream on top? Oh, man. And then the candy apples. Okay, these might actually convince me to get a candy apple, because these actually look great. And then we got our trifle cakes. Now, the HHN trifle cakes were pretty good, so I'm hoping these are going to be even better. What is that? That is definitely candy cane. Oh, my gosh. I think th I'm going to get this. I'm going to get this in a little bit. And then this one? I, I don't even really know what that one is. And then look, they even have nuts too. Okay, so the thing is, we kind of have a little family tradition where we make cinnamon almonds, so this is right up my alley. Let's make our way into the hallway where we find the character portraits. Oh my gosh, look, there's, there's Kevin. Is that, that's the same picture that he used for HHN. <laughs> Okay, so I'm probably gonna be one of Earl's top nuts because I don't see my picture just yet, so they're probably still processing it. I like the little bulletin board that they have here. Oh man, that that right there, that is definitely some Gravity Falls font. Earl's gift wrappers of the seasons. Yeah, this is gonna be probably the rest of the character portraits, so who knows? They got a lot of choices for where they want to put me. Whoville Sanitation Department. Oh man, this is definitely Grinch. Oh look, here's the lounge fly. I called it. <laughs> We've got some candy, cotton candy, popcorn, rock candy, chocolate bars, I got everything. Oh my gosh, even more plushes. Um, this, this thing looks kind of demonic. It's kind of scary actually. Again, universal, we're in 2021. The word naughty can be used in many different ways. Oh, is this like one of the spirit jerseys? It looks really cool. To say the Grinch. Yeah. Then some ornaments, pins, earrings, looks like. Yeah. And then here's one of the wax makers. So, yeah, we got a Christmas tree in this one. Pretty cool. Take it, it's still, yep, $6. Here we go. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is great. Oh, the Harry Potter room. It's themed to the Yule Ball. It's perfect. All right, now I should point out, I'm a Gryffindor, so. What's my little area? Oh, I'd wear this. I, I would wear this. Oi! <laughs> Maybe not. What are these, just little wooden plaques or whatever? I'd buy this. Looks pretty cool. Then we got, I take it, these are scarves? Yep, these are scarves. I don't want to mess them up, but feel very soft, feel very cozy. And then you got these cute little bags up here. This like leather. Oh yeah, that's leather, all right. Then down here we got some headbands, like bows and whatnot. 
hair ties, whatever you want to call them. I'm taking a look at some of the more fragile items here that I probably shouldn't touch. Could whip up some Mino drinks in this thing. Okay, okay, then don't don't get any ideas. Don't get any ideas. Yeah, I could fix myself a nice cocktail in this glass and then throw it on this nice little stone coaster. <laughs> oh my gosh, they even have stockings. Oh my gosh. They have everything in here. It's fantastic. Hogwarts ornaments. Oh my gosh. Yule ball costume ornaments. Look, they even have <laughs> they even have Harry's trunk and a Hogwarts letter. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, look at the little plushes. Oh my gosh, look at Dobby. Oh, he is so cute. I want him. I want him. How much is he? Now let's walk towards the exit. Oh man, am I hearing the Weird Sisters? <laughs> I am hearing the Weird Sisters. But also these very pretty trees. But I also decided to treat myself to the candy cane trifle cake. This looks great. Alrighty, well, uh, camera's fogging up. Uh, what is this? Oh, that was a piece of fondant. It's an actual candy cane? Mmm. That was a good candy cane. All right, let's try and get a good piece of the uh, cake. Oh my gosh. Doesn't this look fantastic? Here we go. Oh my gosh. That is amazing. Oh my gosh, I love that. that I don't think I could have made a better choice. Now I should also mention, I'm not the biggest fan of candy canes, but this thing, if I can get it on the spoon, maybe. Okay, hopefully we don't drop it. Mm. Oh my gosh, those are so much better than the HHN trifle cakes. Like, the frosting is much lighter, the cake is much is more moist. Oh my gosh, this thing is fantastic. Alrighty, well, the trifle cake is gone, but are you really surprised at how quickly I ate this? It was delicious while it lasted. If you want me to be honest with you guys, I will give that a 10 out of 10. That thing blew literally every single HHN treat out of the water. I don't know how they did it. Like, they, they knocked it out of the park with just that item alone. Alrighty, well that basically concludes our first look at the 2021 Holiday Tribute Store. I gotta say, Universal really knocked it out of the park with this one. And the turnaround too. Let's talk about the turnaround for a second. 11 days, or well, 11, 12 days, you know what I mean. Still, it's impressive. Now I will be coming back later on to actually buy some stuff, but given that today is the first official day of Holiday Tribute, I kinda wanted to take it a little bit easy with just a treat purchase. But speaking of treats, if there is anything you guys saw in the little case line, whatever you wanna call it, that you think looks interesting and you want me to try, let me know in the comments and I'll get it. So yeah, I guess I'm just gonna hang out around the park for a little bit. Um, obviously without the camera, I do wanna enjoy myself for the time being. So. If y'all enjoyed the video, give it a like. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button and turn on my notifications down below. Thank you all so very much for watching. Love you all so much. Have a happy holiday season. Take it easy and stay beautiful, my friends.